Oh, boy. Well, hello. I heard you guys were making the rounds again. All right. <clears throat> this one's all you, Tiger. Come on. Police! Hey, ma'am. Thank Come. God. Here, hold this. The lasagna's burning. Okay. Um, Get the dog, but don't let it touch the baby. Okay. Peralta. Yo, I looked at the photos of your victim on your desk. It's that Peralta? Oh, I said hi. The puncture wounds are similar to a case I had a while back. They aren't from a knife. I think it's something spiral, like a corkscrew. <laughs> don't shush me. I'm helping you. No, no, I'm holding a baby. That was actually very helpful. Thank you. Uh oh. You better get back here, now. Oh! Hello, Peralta. Oh! No, no, no! I don't know why you're so upset, man. I'm the one who had to come to this backwater stinkhole. What's up, little man? What's up? You feeling sexy, huh? Yeah, I feel sexy. Yeah, you look sexy. You man. know I do. Watch out for that door. Yo, how much you bench? Seriously. Ooh, brownies! I'm taking two so I can parcel them up and eat them at my leisure later on. Much healthier. You're taking two? Yeah, um, but one of them is for Tilly. Yeah. Why don't you send that to him in Costa Rica? Um, I'm just gonna hand it to him right now. <laughs> okay, weirdo. Why is that? Why is that weird? She said she's gonna give it to him right now. <laughs> <laughs> she's probably going to because they sit next to each other. Yeah, they used to. Toby works here again. Oh, can you imagine? Oh, no. Uh, you don't know. I don't know. What? You should probably just meander back there. Take a look, see if, hmm. he's, see if he's back. Dare I? <laughs> you know what, I'm going to. For old time's sake. Great practical joke, Jim. Got me go to the annex. Oh no, God! No, God, please, no! 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 Hello, Raymond. Captain Wunsch, good to see you. But if you're here, who's guarding Hades? It's Deputy Chief Wunsch now. Unsurprisingly, I've been promoted above you, and now I'm here to evaluate you. What happened to Brand? He retired and moved to Charleston to be closer to his grandchildren. So much for dying at your desk with little dignity. Interesting. I will attempt to cooperate with you under these new circumstances. Don't sweet talk me, Halt. I gave it my best shot. Let's begin. And since my arrival, Violent crime has gone down by 17.3%, as you can see here. Two-toned graphs? You think you can distract me from this precinct's problems with a flashy presentation? Same old Ray Holt. All sizzle, no steak. I'm off to do some spot checks. Oh my god, she's totally gonna flunk us. I haven't gotten an F since I failed recess in second grade. Teachers need a break too, Amy. We were doomed the minute she slithered into the precinct. It's funny. When we first met, we had some good times. Looks like we both want that stapler. Seems that way, based on what happened. <laughs> <laughs> so when did it all go south? 1989. I was up for a big promotion, which would have fast-tracked my career. Wunsch offered to write a letter on my behalf, but instead she torpedoed me because of something that happened the night before she was to turn it in. Madeline. Would you care for a drink? I'd love one. I'm sure you can tell I'm quite drunk. I've had a couple to build up the nerve. I think we both know what I'm about to say. Raymond, I don't think we need to say anything. I'm gay. That's what I was going to tell you. Well then. She sabotaged my career because I refused to bed her. Nothing good will come. Wait. She's here, isn't she? Hi, Ron. 
Tammy. Good. Good start. I'm sorry about this, but I just really want to talk to you. Couldn't we go have a cup of coffee? Let's get this over with. Thanks, Ron. It means a lot. You're a miracle worker. Do you know what you just did? Yes, Donna. I got two people to put aside years of hostility and open a door to the possibility of friendship. You were not here when Ron and Tammy got divorced. I was. Those two are crazy. Yeah, and you just opened the gates to crazy town. Frankly, I think Ron was acting like a baby a little bit. I mean, what is he afraid of? Tammy's just a woman, a nice woman. You know, she's not a murderer. She's not a dragon. It's really good to see you, Ron. You've aged horribly. You son of a bitch. It didn't take Oh long. my God! Not what is your idea. problem? Nothing's changed, has it? Change. Who set the bed on fire, Excuse huh? me. I did, okay? Oh, is that what you want to eat? Hey, we're fine, okay, we're I'm fine. So Please, sorry. Fine. Oh take it God. easy. When you meddle in someone's personal life, it's just so rewarding. Uh, mm. oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, yes, baby. Got it. Usual place. What's going on? Um, somebody vomited right in the middle of the carpet in my office. I don't think that's vomit. Check it out. Me? Check it out. Don't be a wuss. Just get known. Pull in your coffee. Tell me what it is. Oh, that's rude. What is it? What is it? No, just tell me what it is. Michael, I, I, I gotta get out of here. I can't hold my breath that long. Open the door up. It smelled terrible. Oh. Oh, oh, no. Mm -mm. No. Mm -mm. Oh, I cannot believe a pipe burst and left that there. There's no burst pipe. Well, how do you know that? What is it then? Hey guys, somebody making soup? Yes. Hello, yes, I'm looking for a gay nerd named Michael Scott. Who is this? How did you get this number? Your mom, you gay nerd. Oh my god. <laughs> Packer. Paxter. Wacky Pack, how you doing? Hey, listen, did you get that package I left for you? Uh, no. Did anybody see a package here today? No, how big was it? No, it was pretty big. Really? Yeah. Did you see a big package? Where did you leave it? Left it in the middle of your office. Really? Guys, did you see a big package in my office? You mean the thing? Are you kidding me? Oh, that was Packer. Oh, you're, uh, you are dead. You are dead, my friend. That is hilarious. Oh, God. Of course it was you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. It was Packer. I miss you. I miss you, too. Where are you? I'm in my new city council office. No way. I know. Do you like it? I love it. I love it too. Check this out. Here is my wall of inspirational women. Ah, is that a picture of you? Yes. I am big enough to admit that I am often inspired by myself. Here are my clocks, Pawnee and Washington, D.C. Same time zone. Oh, this is the coolest part ever. I have my own private bathroom. Uh, occupied. Oh my god. Oh. Councilman Jam. What are you doing in my bathroom? I don't know if I would call it your bathroom. Its only door is in my office. I think it is crazy that the most junior city councilor gets a private bathroom just because she is a girl. Excuse me? Let's solve this. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna drop my liquids in here, take my solids down the hall. Deal? No, no deal. Fine, your loss. How? 